today by having the, the guilty verdict, he doesn't have a chance now to kill anybody else. One local family says they have finally found some closure. Good evening and thanks for joining us. A jury reaches a verdict in a Vigo County murder trial. The jury found Earl Taylor guilty in the 1975 murder of his first wife, Kathy Dean Taylor. It's Taylor's second murder conviction. News 10's John Swanner got reaction from the courtroom after the verdict was read. John? Well, it took the jury only about five hours of deliberation to convict Earl Taylor of murdering Kathy Dean Taylor. Taylor claims he came home from a day of errands to find Kathy dead in her bathtub from an apparent accidental electrocution. Prosecutors painted a much different picture, saying those errands were part of a premeditated murder, which included a life insurance policy on Kathy. Forensic pathologist Dr. Roland Corr believes Kathy was drowned face down in the tub, and the jury agreed. We spoke afterwards with Kathy's sister and Vigo County Prosecutor Terry Modison. So it's very satisfying to know that Kathy's family has been waiting for 41 years for justice and to know that today they finally got justice. He killed her. He killed her and he did not pay for that. And because he didn't pay for that, he killed again. Now, as we mentioned, this is Taylor's second murder conviction. He was also convicted in the late 1980s of murdering his second wife, Mindy. Members of, her, members of her family came to the courtroom for today's verdict. They declined to be interviewed, instead choosing to spend time with Kathy's 86-year-old mother. Back to you. Thank wow. you, John.